Yo, what is up, you guys? Back for another video. In today's video, we're going to be doing a part two to the things that need to be stopped in 2021, 2022, 2023, 2020 future. You feel me now? Uh, I've already done a part one. If you've already seen it, great. If you haven't seen it, I, you can go watch it. I mean, it's not like you have to watch part one. Then you have to watch part two. I mean, you can watch either or at any time. I don't really care. Um, So I'm going to be filming two videos today. I'm going to be filming this one. And I'm going to be filming another gameplay video. Yes, sir. Um, I've been doing a lot of reactions. Now, look. Right here, man. Like, I'm, bro. Why are you not watching the older videos? Not older videos. But why aren't you watching these type of videos? I don't understand why you're not doing that. You feel me? Especially if you're new around here, man. And you're just, you're, you're, uh, and you're just now knowing about me, man. Um, we're just gonna have a great time, man. We're gonna be talking about these <clears throat> four topics, um, uh, just like the last video, man. I might get a little crazy because last time it did get a little crazy. Um, let's get into it. Oh, what's happening? Eight people. Whoa, 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 what's up? Whoa, whoa, what's on my chat? What's on my chat? Now, the first one I want to just get out of the damn, holy shit. Now, the first one I want to cover that I've covered a lot on this channel, teachers, man. Especially because I'm in high school right now, man. Senior, open blocks. I'm just living life, man. But these teachers, man, I've already spoken about them a lot. Go check out the videos, man. I don't really have to sit here and keep telling y'all to go watch them. But let's talk about teachers, man. I've had an encounter with a teacher that just needs to be stopped. Like, these teachers are real life trying to disrespect me. It's like, bro, I am a senior. I have my years of rep. I am not no freshman. I'm not no sophomore. I have years under my belt. So I low-key deserve some respect. Especially because if I'm trying to explain myself and you're purposely cutting me off, let me let me explain. Let me explain. So cafeteria, right? So there's this thing in our school. It's called RTIs or pause class, right? Because I go to North. North High School, North Wildcats. If you go to that school, then you fucking know what I'm talking about. So look. I'm over here sitting here and I, okay, so I'm a senior. So since like, I'm a senior, like sometimes like the flexi skate be like tripping out. Uh, that's like when you pick your RTI. So I didn't have an RTI. So I have D lunch. I'm in the cafeteria with my boy Marlon. We just sitting there chilling. I, since I, I went to, I was like, oh, let me go check my RTI. I check it and there's nothing there. So what do you want me to do? There's nothing there. There's nothing there. And I have to stay for fourth block. I only have two classes, third and fourth block. So I get there around like 11. So I don't have no classes to go. I don't know where to go. So I'm like, all right, let me see if I can just try to stay in the cafeteria. Let's see if they'd be nice and just let me stay in there. So there's this one black teacher that I've never seen before. Uh, she's like a, I don't, I don't know, what, she's not even a teacher. She's like a para. Also, she's like, she's a para, man. So she's the one that like runs the cafeteria. Like she's the main one to be in there. So I'm, I'm just sitting here. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna ask her real quick so I can just like see if she can let me stay out here. I'm a senior, man. Have years under my belt. At least I like, at least she'll just let me slide, you feel me? Because I don't have nowhere else to go. So where do you want me to go? So I go, when me and Marlon walk over there because the security guard is literally howling at us, telling myself, check in, check. It's like, oh my, like I just got done eating, drinking milk. I got done eating and drinking milk and you over here howling us, grabbing your lip. Like, like bro, come on, that's, that's, that's BS, that's BS. So we finally go over there and she was just like some, oh, where's your name on the shit, uh, like the sheet? <laughs> Where's your name on the sheets? So I said some. All right, listen. I tried to explain her. I said, listen, we don't really have, um, we don't really have an R. I don't have an RTI. I checked it. She, I'm in the middle of explaining it. She just cuts me off and says, go to attendance, go to attendance, just like that. So basically, what I'm really trying to say, there's a full story to this, and honestly, I don't want to do it because it's gonna take a while. But that's just the type of respect that they give me. I am not no freshman. I am not no sophomore. I'm a grown ass man. I, I deserve some respect, such because I've been there for four years now. BS. All right, on to the next one. All right, so just like the last episode, some of these topics might be controversial, man. So if you get a little sensitive, I don't, bro, if you get sensitive, man, I don't want to even hear you speak. If you're literally walking around getting sensitive from videos, you dead ass don't need to be nor into that, you feel me? But the, um, this is just a quick one. Like, TikTok needs to be canceled. Now, let me tell you why. I post on TikTok and I try to gain traction on TikTok. They don't promote none of my vids. They don't promote nothing. But if I go to my For You, I see a literal 
child literally doing some wop dance. I'm not gonna try to do the dances because I can't dance. Y'all have already seen. Can't dance. So it's like, bro, they're over here doing some cringy dances. Literally 15 year olds over here twerking. Like, how do you, how do you, how do you push that, but not push my hard working YouTube videos? Yes, that's where I promote my videos. And I also promote my videos on Snapchat. Go add me if you want to, whatever. No, literally, I'm over here putting hard work into them videos that y'all seem to like. Um, yeah, like, they just don't ever promote. I literally get zero views in like six hours. Six hours go by, it's just zero views. I don't understand how TikTok works, man, but y'all need to be canceled, man. Y'all promoting little kids twerking and shit. Uh, just a bunch of bullshit, man. That shouldn't be promoted. Next one. Now, here's a huge issue I've been seeing on my For You. Huge issue that's been going on for years, centuries, before I was born, before you were even born, probably. You feel me? Women have to stop promote, provoking. What the fuck did you just say? Somebody come and get this boy. Women have to stop provoking men. You feel me? They have to stop that. Now, um, if you guys don't really know what I'm talking about, like here's a video, here's a prime example video that I'm talking about. Just roll it. You're ugly. Call me a bitch again and I'm about to get back. Yeah, like, and I'm about to get back. Yeah, oh my God. Call me a bitch again. So in that video, you can clearly see Call me a bitch again, I'm about to get buggled. That's what she says, and she's just screaming in his face. Now, okay, he probably did call her a bitch, right? But don't be screaming in his face. Be like, hey, and if he and if he really like was on that stuff with you, with the girl, go get your brother, go get your dad, go get your uncle, go get one of them people. That then they're gonna really show him. Then she's on his face. He says, get out of my face, get out of my face. And then he literally throws her across the gym. Now First things first, the dude, he needs his ass beat instantly. Instantly, bro. I don't care how, I don't care if a girl like this close to my face, she's screaming, calling me a bitch or whatever, pushing me or something. Not finna literally just grab her and throw her and then like hit her when she's on the ground. Oh, while she's on the ground, dude, you tripping, bro. You tripping. And I don't care what no one has to say. Men putting their hands on women is never okay in any circumstance, unless it's specific reasons. If a girl's trying to kill you, she's literally beating the shit out of you and you need to use self-defense. That is the only time it is okay to put your hands on a female. If you're literally arguing with a female, you just get the book. Bro, come on, you weird, man. You really weird. And I know people that like to watch it. I'm not gonna say your name for privacy reasons, but you know exactly what I'm talking about, especially black women. I almost said your name, but you know who I'm talking about because I know you're watching. But nah, man, that that's not okay. She shouldn't be that close to his face at all. Go get your brother, go get your dad, go get your uncle, go get some, go get somebody that that let him know. Like, don't disrespect her. You feel me? Um, so that needs to be stopped in 2020 everywhere. You feel me? Um, yeah. Now the last one, Loki gets me the most. Drugs. Drugs. Now. I know most of y'all really don't know me. Like, like y'all don't really know me. I don't smoke. I don't drink. I don't do anything of the sorts of drugs. On my, on God, on God, I don't do any of that, right? Because some people are like, oh, black dreads, you smoke. Mm, no, not how it works. Especially if you honestly get to know me, you know I don't do any drugs. I don't smoke. I don't drink. You know, I don't do none of that. So there's a there's so many people at our school that literally smokes and I'm not talking about I'm not talking about oh a little small amount I'm dead ass off in half the fucking school literally smokes drinks does all that action is now I was literally talking to this dude he has the same name as me actually I don't know who he is he's like a, he's like a, I think he's like a freshman now or a sophomore and I was talking to this man this man said he's done acid before acids he's literally did acid, Zans, he's done Zans, acid, weed, he smokes weed every day, every day, there's people literally, people, and I didn't understand this, people literally wake up out of bed and just, they can't live without it, you also feel like, they can't function without weed, they can't function, so it's kind of weird to see a person that's not even functioning, that's not even functioning on their own, trying to talk shit to other people, it's like, bro, you need weed to be normal. You need a substance to be normal. And then every time I ask them, because I be kind of interviewing them sometimes, I be like, oh, so why are you even doing drugs in the first place? They say stress. Hmm, you're a real dumbass, huh? Real dumbass. You do acid, you do Zans, you do weed. 
you do weed, you do drugs, because you're stressed in high school. Now that's possible. I'm not gonna lie, you can be stressed in high school. But my thing is, it's like, bro, if you're stressed, there's other ways to even, you can, you can do a lot of things. You can play the game, that's what I do. Uh, you can do a lot of other things. You can do active things. You can do all types of things. But what is making you going stress? Let me just smoke weed because, like, you don't... If you've never smoked weed before, how do you know it's a stress reliever? You feel know I me? Mean? I feel like they do it because they want to be cool. Now, that's my opinion. I feel like half the people at our school that are either younger or older, I feel like you do drugs because it's cool. But then you get hicked on it and you get, like, addicted. You feel know I me? Mean? Nicotine, dad pens, people are literally just, they're fiends. They're literal fiends, and y'all know what I'm saying. Then they, then they could be younger than me. This is where Loki really gets me. Nah, I ain't gonna lie, I might lose my mind. They'd be like, they'd be like, don't do drugs like me. Well, first, I don't do drugs. And you're younger than me. Don't do drugs like I am. You talking to me like you an old head. I don't like that, man. If you do, If anyone does that again, I promise you, bro, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Woo! Ooh. Oh my god. I just I, I just don't like it, man. I don't like when people are younger than me saying, Oh, you don't do it like I do. It's like motherfucker, you're the dumb bitch. You're the dumb bitch here, you feel me? Any female, if you smoke, if you drink, if any man smokes or drink, I instantly think you're trying to be cool. And honestly, if you offer me something, I'm gonna politely say, nah, I'm good. But then if you press me about it. Y'all don't understand how many times that's happened, man. Like, just getting pressed about, like, smoking. And, like, it just makes me so angry. It makes me so mad. But, nah, man. Those are the things I've just been talking about in this video, man. Last video, you can go check it out. Uh, I, keep for I keep forgetting to tell you to like the video. Like the video. Subscribe if you're definitely new. If you're seeing this on TikTok somewhere, subscribe, man. Subscribe, like the video. Man. Like the video. Like the video, man. Like, like the video. Like the other, like the videos, man. I'm not gonna lie. Like, like button, not like the video. Like button. Because some dumb bitch was confused when I said go. I don't know. I'm not gonna do that. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed. I'm out.